Geometry Dash was last updated over four years ago, so when the top drops a sneak peek for update 2.2 just out of nowhere, that is a pretty big deal. I decided that it would be fun to record my reactions to this hyped sneak peek presentation. Believe it or not, you can actually look up the video on Google. And you can see before it even starts that it is a minute and 44 seconds in length. So after my initial reaction, I'll probably go back and record an analysis of it to see what is in the video that is important that I don't want to miss. I mean, already in the thumbnail, you can see three new icons, one of which is a park face icon, which is very interesting and I don't know how to feel about. But hopefully this video will show all kinds of new things that we've been looking forward to and show off the things that we've already been shown a little bit of, because this has been a long time in the making and I really am excited to see what comes. All right, only a minute left. And look at the chat flying. There's so many people on there all excited. Total of people waiting 94,927, that's crazy. And 200,000 likes total too. That's starting. And I'm gonna close the trap because I don't want to have that as a distraction for this. 10 more seconds. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and it begins. school already. Yeah. Yeah. There's swing. First we all good luck at swinging mode. Turning stages. Watch your step. Mm. I think this is platformer mode. This actually looks really cool. Alright, it's over. But yeah, that, that was really, really cool. Alright, now I'm booting up my video editor, and I'm going to put the previous recording in there, and I'm going to go frame by frame and look at everything and just see what exactly I missed. Alright, first thing, you can already tell the ground looks new, the background's hard to see with this dark color, but it looks new. All kinds of new objects. That the orb seems either just a decoration on the orb, or that's like a new orb that does something different. It's hard to tell. But yeah, now, now we can see the background. That is definitely not something we've seen before. Those block designs are like, I don't really know how to describe them, but definitely something new as well. I, mean, I, I know what those are because of people who are colorblind and aren't able to see the portals very well. It shows what the orbs and the portals are with the arrows and the symbols and stuff, so colorblind people can play well. He announced that recently, and it's definitely a good idea. I like school already. Yeah, that effect. That effect where the camera just stops already. and then you go forward. Uh, another thing I noticed is this song is not the Explorer song. Meaning it's very likely that there is a second level, and that this is that second level. Because I, I know this is not the same song as the Explorer song. Yeah, look at that. The spider goes on the wall, and then changes and goes onto the other wall. And keeps going along the walls, and then just goes through like normal. You get some kind of interesting potion, and it looks like you have to hit the yellow block. They probably trigger something so you can get through. 
apparently jumping is switching gravity like a ball would, but it's not ball. It's very clearly a cube. That's interesting. Uh, that's cool. Yeah. Is and gets into swing mode. Yeah, it looks it's a lot more smooth than like the version that you can make from Duo Ball already. It's definitely a lot more smooth. And then the you go in the cube portal and the level just turns to the side. Very cool effect. Now it's upside down backwards. Yeah, it's it's robot game mode, so that's not new. But everything else on the screen definitely is. And then dies right there before you get to see anything else. However, we can see what this is. It looks like it would have been going like upwards. Uh, upwards ball parrot, which is very, very cool. And there's this little conversation between Scratch and Rub Rub. Says we're being watched. I definitely think this has something to do with the story mode being extended. It definitely makes sense for it to be extended, and this is more evidence about being watched. That it was a common theme in the original story mode. Meet me down the road, watch your step. The fact that watch your step is green definitely makes me think it means something. Or watch your step probably has to do with the platform remote thing that comes afterwards. So platform mode probably has to probably has a very interesting relation to the story then. So maybe there aren't real platform mode levels like the main levels, but all the platform mode levels made go with the story mode. That might be what it is. Because now we see this goes into what looks kind of like a Mario level with poison and, and moving objects and all kinds of new stuff. Looks very cool. Platform mode and showcases it all. Look at those moving, smashing object things. And it continues after. And that kind of just dies before you can see anything. But it does look like a cool new enough effect. And there is a demon there staring us down. And that is the end of the sneak peek. I'm expecting that there is some stuff in there that I did miss. Considering everybody in the community cares a lot about this, I'm sure someone else can find everything. And there's going to be a lot of things out there that everybody's picked up on. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to subscribe. And I'm King of Petitions, and I'll see you next time.